And right now, a group of musicians is hoping to help vets in Western New York and make sure the men and women who've paid the ultimate price for our freedom are not forgotten. All new for you this morning, Jeff Slauson, showing us how you can help these musicians on a mission. It's my pleasure to be here for the Gold Star Moms and Veterans and all of you. So thank you for inviting me. Remembering those that have not come back from military service. And that to me, just like our support for Gold Star Mothers, is a, is a really sacred cause for us to support. It's a virtual concert raising money for veterans. If we have even a medium intake, it will surpass $5,000 over the nine weeks. This virtual concert is put on by Buffalo Blues. It's the ninth one they've put on to raise money for veterans charities. And this show, for Memorial Day. We have raised close to $70,000 for veterans charities. Bob James is the director of Buffalo Blues. His family has a very long history of serving in the military. I recently learned that actually my family goes back to a guy named John Gibson that fought in the American Revolutionary War. And while he never served himself, he felt he needed to give back to those who do. It doesn't even scratch the surface when what, when what a veteran does or a military family does that's lost a child in the military. What they've contributed is, has nothing, you can't compare that to what we've done with this project. He didn't let COVID-19 stop the mission. And while these concerts would usually be held in person, Facebook Live is a fine substitute, bringing four artists from all over the country in every week with donations given via Venmo and PayPal. Take the money that comes in and we buy tops cards and we take those to a couple of veterans charities that know what veterans are in genuine urgent need and they get them into their hands. These concerts happen every single week with four different artists given 15 minutes for their set. They happen on the Facebook page for Buffalo Blues. We have a link to that on our website right now at WKBW.com and a link for how you can donate. Jeff Slauson, 7 Eyewitness News.